Then, early in the morning of August the 21st, 1969, a fire broke out in the Al-Aqsa Mosque. When the flames were finally extinguished, the ancient roof had been destroyed and the historic minbar lay in ashes. It was an agonizing blow, an unimaginable loss. The fire was started by a firebomb, and the Muslim world, outraged, suspected a Zionist plot. But the culprit turned out to be a Christian zealot, an Australian called Dennis Michael Rohan. Israel, the trial of Dennis Michael Rohan was a top security affair. The prisoner was shielded by a bulletproof glass booth, but the Israelis ensured that the trial was conducted with the necessary legal dignity and formality. Although the plea was entered as not guilty, Rohan, seen here with his lawyer, later admitted starting the blaze, but pleaded insanity. The 28-year-old accused claims to follow the teachings of an extreme Christian sect and says he was guided to fire the mosque after receiving a sign from God.